Nation. It's your boy, Curtis, a.k.a. Flex. Now, as you guys know, I am about uh, 19, 18, 19, maybe even 20 days away from my uh, next power, my third powerlifting meet. As you guys know, this is my third one, but this is actually the first one of 2018. Uh, I finished my peaking program, as you guys know, so between the p end of the peaking program, straight until the actual uh, powerlifting meet, I'm basically uh, doing another form of pro another program to just to have something to do in the meantime of uh, actually uh, coming to my actual meet. So as you guys know, I'm actually doing the peaking program. That is, our, you're actually doing the program that is called the Kaizen program. Now, the Kaizen program is made by three guys. I actually tagged them in my uh, last video. If you haven't seen it, actually, I'll put it into a playlist and you guys could take a look at that video as well. But, anyways, that being said, this is going to be consisting of day uh, three and four of that uh, program. So, just take a look at uh, what I put together on the exercises that it consisted of the day three and four of this program. I'll get back to you guys. When it's finished hey guys now in this actual uh, workout it consisted of uh, two supersets like you guys seen in the first video and uh, what it had is it had the close grip uh, pull downs it required two sets of eight I decided to use uh, 120 pounds for the uh, close grip pull downs and then after I actually wanted you to superset it with skull crushers. So what I did is I actually wanted two sets of eight as well. So I used 70 pounds as uh, the weight that I used for the skull crushers. And uh, that was basically what uh, set one consisted of. After that, it had to go into uh, doing chest supported rows. Now, I don't know if you guys know what chest supported rows is. Basically, it's like being on a regular bench, as you guys see there, with a little, little incline. And basically rowing as if you were doing any type of barbell row. Now you're doing two sets of eight is requiring. I used uh, a 90 pound uh, barbell to do the uh, exercise and uh, moved on to doing the uh, one arm cable uh, tricep pull downs. And it required you to do two sets of eight. Again, all of these uh, exercises today is basically uh, sets of eight. And uh, I used 23 pounds on the actual machine. And again, like I said, did two sets of the eight. And to finish it out for the day, it uh, required me to do uh, barbell curls with basically uh, another two sets of eight using, uh, I use a 60 pound uh, barbell to uh, finish off that part of the exercise. And that was what consisted of the, I believe, day three of the uh, Kaizen program. Now day four consisted of having uh, squats. Uh, first thing he wanted me to do squats with three sets of uh, five reps. I believe it wanted me to use 70% of my one rep max, so I used uh, 310 for the exercise today, and I actually did it low bar instead of high bar. And again, three sets of five. And then after that, it required me to do a close grip bench press. Uh, I pretty much used the uh, power rack for most of the exercises today. And uh, I did three sets of five, requiring me to again yeah, use 70% uh, of my one rep max, which is 185. And I did three sets of five, then moved on to actually doing incline bench press again, using the same power rack as well, and uh, using 70% as well. So I sticked with the same 185 poundage, and uh, used and I did three sets of five reps. And then finished it off doing uh, overhead press and uh, it required me to do three sets of five reps with again the 70 percent which would make it 145 pounds and uh, that is pretty much how uh, day three and four of the kaizen program went uh, so far guys all right guys so as you guys can see that is basically what the actual program consisted of uh, as I told you, I'm going to be following just uh, not only these guys, this, this guy's program, but I'm going to be doing more different uh, power building and power lifting type of programs just to give you guys an example of different programs you guys could even follow in and, and take under advisements yourself. If you guys want to actually, uh, you know, get these programs, you could actually contact me by email or I can actually find different ways of sending you guys uh, links to, you know, not just the programs that I'm doing or maybe I'm, after all this, I'll even set up my own program and just give you guys a different way of, uh, you know, doing it yourself. And uh, hopefully, you know, we all could get strong and get better together. Because again, you know, my goal is always to get stronger and 
why not spread the love and share you know all this information that I possibly can with you guys as well so again uh, this is one of the uh, many programs I'm going to be following and just to give you guys a you know visual example of what it benefits could do for you and hopefully you guys will take it into uh, you know context and actually make make something for yourself and uh, hopefully you know get stronger gains so again uh, this one's going to be Kaizen this is actually day three and four of the program make sure you actually uh, take a look at all these things if you're interested in doing some power lifting or power building type of things and uh, again, I hope that you guys are liking it. If you guys are liking the content, make sure you hit that like button because liking is one of the best ways to let me know that you guys are actually liking the content. Make sure you comment in the comment section to, uh, again, let me know what you guys think of my idea of, you know, giving you guys different programs that will help you out in the gym, making those gains, getting stronger, and having uh, the physique to show for your strength as well because that's, again, one of the objective of being a power builder is to have the aesthetics and still have the strength to go with it so make sure you guys let me know in the comment section what you guys think of the idea that i get i brought to you guys make sure you subscribe if this is the first time you check out this channel because again this is the first of many different uh programs that i'm going to be showing and sharing with you guys so this is not the end there's a lot more to come i have a lot more plans a lot more ideas coming to this channel so again make sure you like comment subscribe you share and suggest Always remember, guys, at the end of the day, to flex them guns. Bullet.